Hello everyone. I'm here with Megatown Matt, and we are playing Medusa Centaur Chess. Centaur Chess is this 10 by 8 board that we have. As you see, there's an extra piece called the Centaur, and we have two of them. It's a knight plus king combo. So it can move anywhere, move and attack anywhere a king can move, and a knight can attack. It's not a royal piece, but it's, yeah. Um, a pawn can promote to that piece. And so we're playing Medusa Chess with that, and that is pieces of the same type, not pawns, so just pieces. Um, let me find my exact rules. Medusa. Pieces of the same type are not allowed to see each other. So piece, where pieces can see are where they can move or attack. Um, so AKA, also known as, I wrote, Pieces as, pieces of the same type are not allowed to be able to attack each other under any circumstance. Just, you cannot go to any position on the board where a piece of the same type could attack an enemy piece of the same type. Are you ready, Matt? Ready as I'll ever be. Nice. Let's begin the blood bath. <laughs> I really like these centaur pieces. Yeah, me too. Um, so we played Cablanca Chess, which has two extra pieces on a 10 by 8. And those are the ones we usually play with. It's a knight plus bishop combo and a knight plus rook combo. So this one gives us the knight plus a non-royal king combo. Which I really like. I really like this piece. Um, so like a knight and a bishop are said to be fairly equal. Bishop a little bit more. But we played knight mate before, where instead of a king piece, there's a royal knight and two non-royal kings. Um... And I think the knight and non-royal king piece are fairly similar in point value, I would say. And same with the knight, bishop, and non-royal king. I would say, I mean, they can all move eight spots. Or no, I guess not all, but the knight and king can move eight spots in an open board. Um, the bishop has the additive range, of course, why it's worth a little bit more. Uh, but yeah. It's a piece of the same type cannot see each other. Yeah, it's gonna be crazy. <laughs> so we have trouble we can get into. I mentioned this right before we start. The one of the things this adds is so like I, if you skewer the king the king to another piece of its kind. So if for whatever reason the king is behind a rook or the king is in front of a rook and I put my rook there where it checks. Mm, I actually have a, I have one question. Uh, does the Medusa rule count only for major pieces? Yeah, so just pieces, not pawns. Okay. So and sure. I got technically not the king, but that's, I mean, the kings wouldn't be able to move next to each other. Unless you're playing atomic. Huh. So yeah, usually, well, like next, uh, yeah, the bishops, the bishops seem to be on opposite colors, but it's not really. I mean, like, yeah. usually the, uh, 
Well, I guess, I don't know. Maybe not. I mean, they're literally on opposite colors. I would usually, oh. I would usually have my king on a light square to start with. Yeah. And then next to it would be a dark square, bishop. Yeah, actually, aren't, was it kings or queens who were supposed to always be on their color? Queens on their color, usually. So, yeah, this is interesting. Yeah, it's weird that they... decided to go an alternate route with that. I'm like a, I'm pretty sure. That's my water. God damn it, Gigi. You go and make yourself cucumber water. What does your cat do? Fucking drinks it. Those are my headphones. They're not a chew toy. Cuddle with me. So yeah, so this is the, I guess, one of the first cases. I guess we could have done it with the centaurs, uh, but I couldn't move my bishop to guard the check. Yep. Um, I'm pretty sure it's the same. Well, I'm going to look up the Cabo Blanca. I'm going to look up Cabo Blanca and see how the king's... Kings in Gothic and Janus and see how the kings look. So Cava Blanca. No, no, that's cow milk. You can't drink that, dog. Damn. Get it off. That's the shit Should call you a little Satan. Is there... Okay. I guess. So Janice, Janice just says king. I didn't, I didn't notice this before. Uh, Janice Chess has king queen on its color, normally, where it has two of the the bishop plus knight combo pieces. Um, Kyle Blanca does not have it on the color. Um. It's it's like this except the two extra pieces are in different places. The knights the knights are one over, and the cop, the Cal Blanca pieces are uh, on the C and H file. And then Gothic chess has the two added pieces next to the king, so it doesn't have the queen next to the king.
I, you know what? I, I would love to be able to see an analysis board for I want to see analysis board for fairy pieces just just because yeah. I want to see I mean I, it people I mean giving values to pieces isn't as simple as like having analysis board but yeah, uh But it would help. Check. Yes, indeed. And so again, with the Medusa rules, my centaur cannot attack his queen because it would be next to his centaur. And I can't move my bishop from d1 to e2 because we would run into the same sort of dilemma. C. Oddly enough, I was planning to just move my bishop there first, and then I noticed it was a free pawn. Yeah. Weird chick. Oh man, Travis. Also, there's there's both of those like three minute like here's how you play chess. I yeah. can't believe you don't know this already. <laughs> Where it's like just images. I wish I had watched those like when they were first posted. <laughs> I was like, ago. wow, that's great information. <laughs> started to apply it and was like, well, you don't say. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Butter my biscuit. Well, I also played, I was playing with a guy yesterday on a, so for those of you watching, for those of you who maybe watch right there, the, or... <clears throat> Otherwise, um, we play a lot of chess. I don't necessarily get better, even though I play lots of puzzles. Now, obviously, take that with a grain of salt. Playing puzzles is not the only thing that makes you get better at chess. Um, it's simply one part of the puzzle. So I've, I've migrated recently, not migrated, but uh, graduated to actually playing against other people on Lee Chess. Um, besides Travis and the other people and like my girlfriend, fiance, uh, other people that we that I come into general contact with. So I was playing with a guy last night, Travis, who was just playing uh, like a casual standard game of chess. And I, I'm like sitting in a meeting playing this because I have to go to these meetings in French. <laughs> and I. <laughs> I'm playing, and I, lo I lose my queen, and he's like, what the fuck? And he's like, take it back. So I, like, do a couple takes backs, and then, like, a couple moves, moves later, I lost my queen again. <laughs> and he's like, God. <laughs> yeah, man, I know. Terrible. So he was mad that, yeah, you blundered? How dare you? How dare you? How dare I? Uh, I mean... Yeah, I don't know. Peep. But it was, it was <laughs> they, they were stupid blunders. Oh, okay, yeah. It was like, I moved, my, he like moved a knight, and it was clearly, if I didn't move my, I was going to lose my knight.
Yeah, I usually just make, I mean, I guess there's been a history of me making mistakes. But I usually make mistakes on when I at least feel time pressured. I'm pretty bad with time pressure, yeah, I think. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, it would be great if there were puzzles where it was like you had 10 seconds. Uh, there's a thing called blitz tactics. And you see how many you can do in 30 seconds or something, and you try to, like, beat your score. Uh, and I think I think if you get it in cor- get correct, you just move. I don't know what it does. Actually, I don't. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I was thinking I should have moved my centaur up uh, to D4 before you could have got yours out. But it was move a bishop. Yeah, I know. moved one off the back rank. Have you done the training stuff on Lee Chess? Not the, sp- like... Yeah, I think you have. I yeah, see. yeah, I've run, I've run through it. I, honestly, I should revisit it. I think, I mean, a lot of... I'll say like some of the stuff, uh, some of the ones where it's like, all right, if you only have a king and a, and a bishop and like a pawn and you need to use the, like the triangle method to get that other king into like the top left hand corner. 
and they show you how to do it a couple times, and then they're like, all right, this time it's on you. <laughs> that, shit, that shit is impossible. <laughs> I'm like, man, but I did exactly what they had me do in the last ones. <sighs> you got me there. I didn't have the... Oh, why is it still on me? I said a pre-move, but now I disagree with it, and I don't know how to undo it. So if, if, I, if I do a pre-move, uh, I might ask for an undo. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Trick's just not doing what you expect me to.
There's other chess videos on that thread that I know I. I haven't looked at. I haven't looked at them in a while, but I. Uh, I'll try to. Like them or something. I don't know if. If they're good. I probably could have done something to avoid all this, you taking that long, but I've decided just to ignore it, and <laughs> <laughs> that is, I, I could have done something probably to help it, but, uh. No, totally. Well, getting your, getting your knight to d4 was great. Yes, yes. I was trying to get the centaur there. That would have been Yeah, killer. that would have been rough. Or maybe not, I mean, maybe not, because then your knight could have just kicked it away. Or maybe if I, I could have maybe just, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. If I were Travis, <laughs> what would I do? Probably this. Yeah, right. not that. Sorry. I don't want to do press and undo. Hmm. No, I won't do that. Oof. Discover attack. Isn't that a tasty piece, Travis? I would have liked to have protected it first. Yeah, uh, that's understandable. I mean, I think I'd be fine, but yeah, it would be. Yeah. I kind of, I mean, I would want to almost 
promote to a centaur. And I would like because it's yeah. on it's on your side of the board. So it could be more useful than a queen. I don't know. Maybe not. I still think I could promote with these four pawns if I needed to. Yeah, you probably could. Double attack. No. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Um, I don't know how much you like to watch chess, uh -huh. um, but there's a big tournament going on today at, um, my, at three and let me chess. Nice. And it's just a few games. Magnus is, it's the not, it's a 960 tournament. So That's sweet. It's an all, all masters. Awesome. I may just check it out. Um, but I'll be definitely watching the Magnus games. He was the winner of the last tournament. He was the world champion, but uh, Here's an idea. So there's the centaur, the bishop plus knight, and the other, the bishop plus, or the knight plus rook. Those three pieces. Yeah. It'd be cool to kind of have a 960 of, you always play with two out of those three pieces. And yeah. it's a 960 on a 10 by 8. And you each oh, get the crazy. same... I think I could be getting towards checkmate here. I definitely won the rook if that's not if I don't have a checkmate here. Yeah, you definitely have the rook. Dang.
and just will be threatening checkmate with the rook gone. On queen to h2. Good game. Yeah, definitely. Medusa Centaur chess. I definitely, yeah, I like both these variants, Centaur chess yeah. and Medusa chess. Hope everyone enjoyed it as well. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye.